All right, guys, here we go. I am Deanna from DC Fit, and we have got a 40 minute, no repeat, full body strength workout. It's just gonna be you, me, and the dumbbells for the next 40 exercises. So you're gonna need a variety of dumbbells for those 40 exercises, right? I have everything out today from my 20 pound dumbbells all the way down to my five pound dumbbells. You're also gonna need something to elevate your heels, all right? We've got some elevated squats today, so be sure to grab something to elevate your heels. Don't forget your water bottle and your towel. We're gonna get started right here with the warm up. Feet out wide, arms out front. Give me a big rainbow reach to the right, open to the center, and now repeat to the left. Good, be sure to follow that rainbow reach with your whole torso, giving me a nice rotation right and left. Taking a few minutes here, guys, to get warm and get loose so that we're ready to grab those dumbbells. Open wide and now to the left. Let's get one more each way. Last time right and now last time left. Good job. Bring it to the center. Give yourself some space for two taps to the left and two taps to the right. Good, two big steps right and left, keeping the arms opening wide to the side. So 40 exercises today, guys, 40 minutes. We're gonna be crushing each one of those exercises today for 45 seconds, all right? Good, let's get two more here to the right and last two to the left. Okay, bring it back center, feet out wide for a hinge right here. We're gonna float the hips back and bring it back center. Good, all the way over and right back up. Good job. Core nice and tight on this hinge. Come up nice and tall. Give me three more here. Two, and last one. Good, knees and toes forward. We're gonna sit low with the squat as we raise the arms up overhead, elbows to ears. Good job. Back in the hips, back in the heels. Sitting down low, coming up tall. Nice, let's get four more right here all the way down and up, last two, and last one. Good, keeping the feet apart, let's drive the heels to the glutes, warming up those quads, add a little bicep curl right there. Good, so 40 exercises. I've divided those up into four circuits of 10 exercises each, all right? So we'll perform 10 exercises and take a break. Nice, let's get three more right here, two, and last one. All right, let's bring it to the end of the mat. We're gonna walk up four, and then we're gonna inchworm four on the floor. All right, here we go. Up four and back. Now inchworm four on the floor. Four, three, two, one. Right back up four, and march it up four. Good, bring it back. Inchworm four on the floor. Walking it out, dropping the hips, walking it right back towards the toes, and up four on the floor. Right back. Good, inchworm four, drop the hips, right back up, last time up four, good job, back, inchworm out floor, hold the plank right here, hips down low, drive that right foot forward to the outside of that right hand, and now let's alternate left and right, good job, driving that foot forward to the outside of the same hand, right and left, let's get four more here, three, two, Last one, drive that right foot forward to the outside of the right hand, drop the left knee, shoestring to the floor. Good job, hold that stretch, pressing that right elbow into the right knee. Big rotation reach right here with that left arm, following that hand up to the ceiling. Good job. Let's get three more right here. Last two and one, left hand down. Let's return the right foot, change it with the left, left forward to the outside of that left hand. Drop the right knee down with the shoestring. Good, pressing that left elbow out into the left knee. Big reach overhead right here with the right hand this time. Following that hand with your eyes. Big reach, let's get three more. Two, and last one, good. Return the left with the right. Walk the hands all the way back to the toes. Roll it up nice and slow. Bring it to the edge of your mat right here. Let's tap back two and then give me two jacks out to the side. Tapping back, good. And then arms wide, tapping side for those half jacks. Good work, guys. Feeling warm and ready for this workout. Two half jacks. Let's get one more set of each right here and bring it to the front. Big arm circles right here. 
high and wide to the front. A couple more here, and let's reverse that high and wide to the back. Nice job. A couple more here, and the last one. All right, guys, I'm going to grab a quick drink, and we're going to get started on these first 10 exercises. I'm going to move some of my dumbbells out front. Again, working for 45 seconds today with that 15 second transition. Quick transition. I'll be talking quickly for that 15 seconds, but keep your eye on the window so that you know, have a little bit of a glance at what's coming up next, all right? So I've also divided today's workout into muscle groups, all right? All our exercises are grouped by muscle, all right? So our first five exercises are all about shoulders, okay? Starting right here, elbows up. We've got a half a press and then a full press, all right? Right here, core nice and tight. 45 seconds. Let's go here in three, two, and one. Here we go. Half a press, all the way up. Good. Just pressing halfway and then all the way. Nice job. Core nice and tight, guys. One exercise at a time today. One 45 second finish line at a time. Good. Again, I've grouped our exercises today by muscle groups. All right, so mind muscle connection right now, all about the shoulders. Just pressing halfway and then all the way. Good job. Just slightly changing our range of motion here. Big press. We got it. We got it. All right, here we go. Give me about 15 more seconds. Good. Half a press and then all the way. Nice job. Here we go. Here we go. Overhead. All right, we got about five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Changing dumbbells. Dumbbell on the right hand. We're going to swing the dumbbell here. Rack it. Give me three presses. Right back to the swing. All right. Right side only. Here we go. We've got three, two, and one. Here we go. Big swing. Rack it here. Now give me three presses. Good. Three solid presses. And right here, give a little swing. Rack it back to the center. Three presses. Good job. Right side only, right here. Good, break it up with this little swing. Hips go back, hips come forward for that rack. Big press overhead. Core tight, don't arch your back on this press. Big swing and rack. Now press it up. Good job, nice. All right guys, we've got about 12 seconds here. We'll take a little break. We'll repeat the same exercise on the left. Boom, right there. All right, here we go. Give me four, three, two, and one. All right, 15 second break. We're right back to the same thing on the left side, all right? Mind muscle connection, all about the shoulders right now, okay? All right, core nice and tight. Left side, let's swing in three, two, and one. Right here, big swing. Rack it up, press three. Good. Overhead, nice and strong, little swing. Power the hips forward for the rack. Big explosion with three presses. Overhead, good job. Slowing down this momentum right there, and then getting three solid presses. Nice job, here we go. Down and up, and big press. Working hard today, 45 seconds at a time, 40 minutes, give me all you got, all right? One finish line at a time. Here we go, all the way up. All right guys, 10 seconds right here. We go to some lateral raises. Big press, those knees are soft. All right, right here we've got four, Three, two, and one. All right, changing your dumbbells. We've got a lateral raise combined with a front raise. So dumbbells out to the side, dumbbells up to the front. All right, here we go. Let's go three, two, and one. Here we go. Lifting side, down, and front. Good, shoulders going low, elbows going high. Lift and squeeze. Nice work. Focusing on the shoulders. We've got one more exercise for the shoulders. Nice job. Lifting front, down, and side. Good, 20 seconds here. We got it, we got it. Lifting and squeezed. Core nice and tight, stabilizing all of this work. All right, 12 more seconds here. And then we're gonna go to bus drivers, all right? Add a little bit of cardio with our bus driver if you want. Right here, we've got three, two, 
and one. All right, dumbbells down. Grabbing my eight pound dumbbell, looks like this. We're gonna jack out, rotate, rotate for the bus driver, in and out. All right, adding that jack is completely up to you. Let's go two and one right here. Up, rotate, rotate. Little jack, right back up, good. Nice job, right there. Little jack, down and up, rotate, rotate. Good. Down and up, lowering the dumbbell right there. Good. Reducing the momentum by not swinging it between our legs. Good, keeping this all in the shoulders, core tight, down and up. You can walk this in and out if you want to. Rotate, rotate, down and up. Rotate, rotate, down and up. Either way, guys, we've got about six seconds. Finish strong. Moving on to legs after this. We've got three, two, and one. All right, moving on to squats. We've got front squats right here. So grabbing your dumbbells, rack right here at your shoulders. We're gonna sit down and up. Keep those elbows up. Let's go two and one. Here we go. Down, big press. Good. Dumbbells racked right here at your shoulders. Good. Down and up. Sitting back in the hips, back in the heels, keeping those elbows up, all the weight right there. Good job. Sitting back, pressing up. Good. All right, 20 more seconds here. <sighs> Inhale on that squat, exhale as you come up. Nice job. <sighs> 10 more seconds. We're gonna grab whatever it is that you, you grabbed to elevate your heels. We've got three, two, and one. All right, so grabbing my little dumbbell here, I'm gonna elevate my right heel only. Right heel elevated. Coming up onto this left toe slightly. Racking right here at the right. Squatting, down and up. Here we go, two, and one. Right side only, down and up. Good. On this left toe right here for balance. On the left heel, or on the right heel, Right heel elevated, all the weight right there. You can just hold this dumbbell right here on your shoulder if you want. Good job. Down and up. Here we go. We got it, we got it. All the way sitting back in the hip, back in the heel on this right leg, using the left right here for balance, sitting down and up. Inhale, up tall and exhale. Chest is up, shoulders back. Good. Nice and strong, guys. Five more seconds here. We're gonna change sides in two and one, good. All right, other side. Elevating the left heel this time. Dumbbell up like this, or again, you can just set it on your shoulders. Left heel elevated up on the right toe for balance. Let's go two and one, right here. Sitting back and up, good. Left heel elevated, all the weight on the left side this time. Sitting back in that left heel, left hip, good. Nice job. Here we go, here we go. Down and up, this is exercise eight. We've got two more exercises. You guys are doing fantastic. Crushing this first circuit of shoulders and squats, right? Here we go, down and up. Good, big focus on the quads here. Sitting back in the hips, back in the heels. Give me seven seconds, guys. Let's finish strong. Down and up. Right here, three, two, and one. All right, next exercise. We've got a goblet squat, single, single, triple. Looks like this. Single, single, triple is out, in, out. Jump in with me right here. One single, one single, now triple, out, in, and out, good, up, single right, single left, triple to the right, out, in and out, good. Sitting back in the hips, back in the heels, single and up, single and up right here, out, in, out and up, good job, give me your singles, nice job, side to side, triple right here, good. Up tall and squeeze, 12 seconds guys, you're doing great. Here we go, here we go. Out, in and out. Exercise nine right here. We've got four, three, two, 
and a one. Good job. All right, grabbing one dumbbell. We've got dumbbell, kettlebell swings. Holding that dumbbell head, we're gonna hinge with the swing. Hips come forward as you propel that dumbbell out. Let's go two and one. Here we go, back and up. Good. <sighs> Inhale as, that dumb, as you hinge and that dumbbell swings right there between your legs. Exhale and explode as the hips come forward. Good. Shoulders back, chest up. We got it, we got it. Good. Exploding with those hips, coming forward. That dumbbell's got nowhere to go but out. Good, here we go. Finishing strong right here. Hinging back, swinging forward. Woo! Wrapping up 10 exercises. We've got four, three, two, and one. Great job, guys. All right, quick break. We're right back at it, all right? We've got about a 30 second break. We'll come back for our next 10 exercises, which are all about the biceps and the back, all right? We've got some core as well. So I'm gonna grab my 10s and my 8s, bringing these forward for our bicep exercises. We've got about 15 seconds, guys. We're gonna start right here with just hammer curls, all right? So grab something that challenges you. I'm gonna start with my 15s here. All right, here we go, bicep hammer curls in three, two, and one. Here we go, good job. Core nice and tight, knees are soft. Give me a nice solid curl right here. 45 seconds, all about the biceps, right? Good, focusing on the biceps for the next few exercises. So give them all you got, right? Here we go. Good, we've got a 40 minute workout. We're giving five of those minutes to isolate a bicep curls, all right? Focusing on each muscle group. Good, here we go. Lift, squeeze, exhale. Nice, 10 more seconds here. Good, keeping those elbows in. Lift and squeeze. Resist the gravity on the way down. We've got three, two, and one. All right, now focusing on one bicep at a time. Open up right here. We're just gonna curl the right side, all right? Right side curl only, palm up. Here we go, right here. Curl it up and lower, good. Up and lower. Nice job. Just focusing right here on that right side. Nice job. Give me a good solid curl. Good, all the way up and right back down. Nice and slow, resisting gravity both ways, right? Good, curl and squeeze. All right, 15 more seconds. Giving this right bicep a little love and then we're gonna switch to the left. Good job. Lift and squeeze. Good, core nice and tight. Finishing right here, three, two, and one. All right, take a little break. Shaking out that right hand, same thing now. Palm up, open your bicep, big curl right here to the left. Everybody ready? Let's go here in three, two, and one. Here we go, lift and curl. Good job. Left arm's probably feeling pretty good. It got a nice long break, right? <laughs> that right bicep had to keep going from one exercise to the next. Good job. Isolating the left side right here. Keep that elbow in, palm up, lift and squeeze. Good. Mind muscle connection. Good job. We got it, we got it. Here we go. One more bicep exercise after this. Focusing on our biceps here. Lift and squeeze. Nice, all right, right here, let's finish. In three, two, and one, good. All right, dumbbell down. Grabbing some lighter dumbbells, palms still up. We're gonna curl to the front, externally rotate, back to the front and down, all right? Here we go. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Lift, externally rotate, and right back down. Good. Squeezing those biceps, getting a little squeeze right there as you open up, and lift. Nice. Holding those biceps up, 
right? Holding these dumbbells up, squeezing the biceps the whole time you rotate. Good, here we go, here we go. We got it. Lift and rotate. Nice. Last exercise for the biceps right here. We're gonna break it up with some core next. Good, lift, rotate, and in, right back down. Core tight, stabilizing all of this work. Good. All right, right here, let's wrap it up in three, two, and one. All right, keeping one dumbbell right here, we're gonna stir the pot, feet out wide, stir the pot to the right, rotate right. Stir the pot to the left, rotate left. Everybody ready? Let's go three, two, and one. Dumbbell out front, stir the pot, big rotate. Stir the pot and rotate, good, core tight. <sighs> Inhale here as you stir the pot, Exhale as you rotate. Good. Nice job. Keep that dumbbell up high. Squeezing those shoulders. Core nice and tight. Big stir and rotate. We got it right here. 20 seconds, guys. Stir the pot and rotate. We're gonna go into some back exercises after this. Nice, big inhale right here and rotate. Here we go, here we go. Five seconds, finish strong. Right here, we've got four, three, two, and one. Nice, all right. Grabbing some medium to lighter dumbbells, palms up, we're gonna hinge over. We've got reverse grip rows with those palms up, and then we're gonna fly the dumbbells out in that same reverse grip, all right, with those thumbs up. Let's go right here, reverse grip row, and now fly the arms up, good. Row it up, and now fly the arms out, nice. So that thumb is on the outside as you raise those dumbbells out to the side. Core tight on this row, driving the elbows up, dumbbells right there, right between your navel and your chest. Good job. Draw those dumbbells up. Good, big squeeze on the back, and then fly out wide to the side. Good, we got it, we got it. Big fly and row. Nice job. Here we go, here we go. Keep those palms facing up. We've got two and one. All right, maybe a little bit heavier now. We've got regular rows with dumbbells facing you, alternating right and left. So maybe grab some heavier dumbbells. Right here, core tight, big hinge. Let's go two and one. Here we go. Again, driving that elbow up. This time, driving those dumbbells to your hips. Core tight. Good, drive that elbow up high. Here we go, here we go. Nice. Getting a good squeeze in your back. Nice. Maybe at first feeling it up a little high towards your shoulder, but then as that shoulder blade comes up and over the spine, start feeling that in your rhomboids. Row it up. Here we go. 15 seconds, guys. Alternated rows. We got it. Drive it up. Good. Right here. Dumbbell to the hip, elbow high, core tight, neutral back. We've got two and one. All right, dumbbells down. Grabbing my lightest dumbbells, my fives, right here, core tight. We're gonna fly out, go to the top, lower, and then reverse, okay? Jump in with me right here, here we go. Core tight hinge, fly to the side, round to the top, lower, now reverse. Lift top, lower to the side. Good job. Kind of a modified around the world. Core tight, lift up, around to the side, and down, good. Fly to the side, round to the top, and down. Good, keep those shoulder blades back. Core tight, neutral back. Here we go, here we go. Up and down. If you need to pop out of this and jump back in, go right ahead, lift overhead, down to the side, good. Fly it out, up top, and lower. All right, five seconds right here, guys. We're gonna go to the floor for a pullover in two and one, good. So again, grabbing maybe that heaviest dumbbell, all right, holding the dumbbell, palms up center. We're gonna lower the dumbbell and lift. Core nice and tight. Let's go two and one right here. Lower, 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 lift and squeeze. Good, palms are up, holding that dumbbell right there in the center. Lower, 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 
lift up and squeeze nice and slow guys core tight belly button into the back up into the rib cage braced into the floor lowering that dumbbell lifting it good job gonna feel this in your back and your chest here we go here we go all the way over and right back up this is exercise nine guys or actually 19 we've got one more exercise for a break here we go finish these pullovers core tight we've got four three two and one good all right wrapping up our back exercises and this circuit we've got four renegade rows or i'm sorry two renegade rows four mountain climbers core tight right here let's go two and one give me two rows dumbbell to hip now give me four mountain climbers good job right back out two renegade rows one left one right give me four mountain climbers nice job keep those feet out wide for balance right on these rows then drive the knees in for four mountain climbers we got it core nice and tight drive four three two one give me two rows good drop the knees for low impact right just get rid of these mountain climbers just performing the rows okay or you can pop up and then give me the mountain climbers right back down okay either way right here we've got five four three two and one great job guys Woo! feeling that in my back that was definitely the back and bicep circuit right okay grab a quick drink guys we've got a break here and then we're right back at it we've got chest this time as well as glutes all right so we're going to be spending some time on the floor at first so pulling your dumbbells over right out of the gate we've got push-ups chest press and flies so make your, sure you have your dumbbells where you want them all right good job 15 seconds again we're going to get started right here with push-ups all right we're halfway there guys 20 exercises in 20 to go push-ups right here fingertips spread wide hands under the shoulders core tight glutes tight down and up here we go down and up good core tight elbows to the back corners of the room right lower 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 then push away from the floor good elbows going out then draw those elbows in good elbows going out now draw the elbows in pushing away from the floor good job nice and controlled shoulder blades back down and up good nice job all the way over right back up 15 seconds right here guys give me a few more down and up and then we're going to turn it over for chest press all right right here we've got five four three two and one all right grab your dumbbells for chest press laying all the way back on the floor right core nice and tight braced into the back braced into the floor elbows just under your shoulders right here let's press two and one here we go pressing up and lower good job as those dumbbells go up you're squeezing your chest good inhale as you lower exhale as you explode those dumbbells up overhead squeezing the chest great job guys 45 second finish lines you are crushing it this is exercise 22 right here we go we got it 12 seconds here we're going to open up our chest workout to some flies all right focusing on the chest right now mind muscle connection we've got three two and one all right dumbbells down we've got those flies now same position core nice and tight belly button into your back up into your rib cage so you're braced into the floor dumbbells overhead we're going to open the arms up wide and then bring it back together jump in with me right here for 45 seconds good lower 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 come up and squeeze the chest good pretend like you're hugging a, a barrel on your way up elbows are slightly bent good job nice resist resist as you lower the dumbbells squeeze as you come up top good work all the way down 
right back up. Up and exhale. Good, 15 seconds here, guys. We're gonna keep the same position, but we're gonna reverse grip our fly, all right? Or our press, not our fly. All right, right here, finish with me in four, three, two, and one. Nice job. All right, I'm gonna switch dumbbells to tens, laying all the way back, just like you were. Dumbbells facing you, palms facing you, elbows along the rib cage. We're gonna lift and lower, okay? Two and one, right here, a big press up and lower, good. Reverse grip press right here, lifting up and lower. Lifting those elbows up, lowering those elbows right there, good. Right there, outside of your rib cage, palms facing you, lift the dumbbells up and right back down. Nice job. 20 seconds here, guys. This is our last chest exercise, lifting up and lower. We've got a couple of core exercises and then we're gonna turn it over to the glutes, all right? Finish these presses right here, lift and lower. We've got three, two, and one. All right, all the way back up. Keeping just one dumbbell for this dead bug, all right? We're gonna extend the dumbbell overhead, core tight, belly button into your back, up into your rib cage, lift the knees, all right? We're gonna lower a leg as we lower the dumbbell. Jump in with me right here, extend, and lift. Good, extend and lift. You do not have to add the arms up over body, all right? If you feel like this is causing your back to arch up off the floor, just hold this dumbbell overhead, all right? Lowering the legs one at a time. Adding the arms overhead adds a little more intensity, all right? Good job, this is a little more advanced move. Core nice and tight, good. And big exhale right there, keeping your back braced into the floor. Good. 10 seconds here, we're gonna come up for a Russian twist. Good, inhale and exhale. All right, we've got two and one. All right, all the way up, grabbing whatever dumbbell you wanna use for our Russian twist. We do have glute bridges next, so make sure you've got a heavy dumbbell nearby so you're set up for glute bridges. So core nice and tight right here, rotating for Russian twist. Good job, side to side. Core tight, rotating right and left. I need to switch dumbbells. Here we go, side to side. Draw that belly button in, keep it nice and tight. Rotating side to side, good. <sighs> exhaling, inhale and exhale. Keeping the core tight, rotating, swinging that dumbbell up and over the side, using your core for stopping and starting this momentum with the dumbbell. Nice, all right, right here we've got four, three, two, and one, good. All right, grabbing that heaviest dumbbell, we've got glute bridges, all right? So again, core nice and tight, same position we've used for this circuit. Right here, we're gonna raise the glutes, raise the hips, big squeeze and lower, all right? Core nice and tight, let's go two and one. Here we go. Pelvic tilt with that tight core. We are lifting a flat back and lowering a flat back, all right? If you feel like your dumbbell isn't heavy enough, all right, just lift the toes. Good. Let's drive the work a little more into the hamstring there. Good, coming up onto those heels, pressing up. Nice job. Lift and squeeze. Again, core tight, pelvis tilted, lifting a flat back, squeezing, lowering a flat back, all right? Good. All right, we've got about 10 seconds here. We're gonna come up to a staggered rear deadlift, grounding that right leg. We've got three, two, and one. All right, all the way up. You need two dumbbells for this. All right, right leg is grounded. Left leg is back. We are gonna hinge for a rear deadlift and then send the left leg back for a lunge. Jump in with me, hinging over right here, stepping back with that left leg, good. Core nice and tight with this hinge, creating a nice neutral back, chest up, shoulders back. Right leg is grounded, left leg is doing all the moving, all right? Good. Isolating all things in that right hamstring and right glute. 
Big hinge right here, sending those hips back, bringing them forward, and then loading them up with that reverse lunge, right? Tapping back with that left toe all the way over, right back up. Good. All right, eight seconds here, and then we're gonna change sides. Fantastic, guys. We've got two and one. All right, changing sides. Grounding the left leg this time. Right is back for balance and for the lunge. So all the weight in the left heel, tapping back with the right leg. All right, let's go two and one. Here we go. Big hinge, hips come up. Step back with that right leg. Good, good. Core nice and tight. Neutral back on this hinge. Inhale, exhale as you come up. Send that right leg back for the lunge. Always watching this front knee, not letting it slide out over your toe. Good. Try to keep it lined up with that middle toe, right? Here we go, 20 seconds. Nice job, guys. This is exercise 29, right here. You guys are busting it. Finishing up our third circuit and one more exercise. Here we go. Wrap these lunges up. We've got four, three, two, and one. All right, last exercise in this circuit. We've got a rear deadlift, all right? So we're gonna hinge, clean it up right here for a squat, right back up to the rear deadlift, all right? Let's go two and one. This is it, big power move. Hinge, push with the hips up, sit right back down. All the way over, hips come up, hips go low. Good, three positions on your hips here, right? They're going back, coming forward, sitting low. Good, all the way over, power up and sit. Nice job. Nice, pressing up through those heels, all the way over, big sit, and right back down. 15 seconds right here, guys. Wrapping, exercise 30, up, right here. Finish strong. We've got five, four, three, two, and one. Wow, great job, guys. That was chest and glutes, which you should definitely be feeling, right? All right, grab a drink. 10 more exercises, guys. These, no repeats, fly by. Good job. And you can really feel the benefit of each exercise towards that muscle group when we group them together, right? So, all right, we're gonna kick it off next with triceps, all right? We've got about, oh, we got about 20 seconds. We're gonna start right here with a staggered stance with a right arm kickback. Just the right arm, all right? Squeezing and isolating our right tricep. So bring it back in about 10 seconds. All right, little extra break here. 15 seconds going into this last circuit. Here we go, right elbow up. Let's go two and one. Here we go, kick it back. Good, core tight. Keep that elbow up, nice. Good, just hinge, kick it back. Try not to swing the dumbbell where you're right here and you're just, you've got all this momentum, right? Using your tricep to lift and lower, right? Tricep is in charge of this exercise. So kick it back and lower. Kick it back and lower, squeezing that right tricep. Beautiful guys, core tight. All right, 10 seconds here. We're gonna turn it over and get even on the left side. Big squeeze, good. All right, we've got three, two, and one. All right, other side, left arm, all right? Again, core tight here, left elbow up, lift and lower. Try to keep it right there at that 90 degree angle, all right? Right here, guys, elbow up. Let's go three, two, and one. Here we go. Nice job, guys. Wrapping up, this is our last circuit, all right? We've got triceps, core, and sumo squats. All right, here we go, focusing on that tricep, core tight, nice. Keep that 90 degree angle, lift and squeeze the tricep, and then lower, making that tricep work both ways, right? Here we go, all the way up and right back down. All right, we've got 15 seconds. And then we're gonna go to that overhead tricep extension. 
So you're gonna wanna grab a heavy single dumbbell. Good, lift and squeeze. Right here, we've got three, two, and one. All right, lighter dumbbells down. Grabbing a heavier single dumbbell, right? Grabbing the head, core nice and tight. You can stagger your stance if you want. Knees soft, elbows forward. We're gonna lower and lift. Everybody ready? Let's go three, two, and one. Right here, down and up. Good, lower, 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 and lift. Good, resist the lower, right? We're not just dropping this dumbbell, we're lowering and lifting using our triceps. Here we go, down and up, good. Keep those elbows forward. You don't want a bowing open like this, keep them forward so that you're isolating that tricep, right? Down and up, 15 seconds guys. And then we're gonna go to tricep push-ups. I like to use dumbbells with my tricep push-up. Feels better on my wrist. You don't have to if you don't want to, or you may want to try it. We've got two and one. Good job. We use it a lot in full body workouts. I'm going to use it right now with my tricep push-ups. Feels better on my wrist. Core nice and tight. Elbows along the rib cage. Elbows going back and up, right? Core tight. Let's go two and one right here. Last tricep exercise right here. Good job. If you're not using the dumbbells and just using your hands, you've got hands and dumbbells under the shoulders, but with your hands, you want those fingertips spread wide so you've got that nice, solid base, right? Good. Pressing away from the floor. Elbows bending, now elbows extending as you push away from the floor. Good job. Inhale on the way down. Exhale on the way up. Go to your knees when you need to. Nice. All the way down, down, down right back up. All right, guys, right here, we've got about five seconds. We're gonna go to a plank exercise in three, two, and one. All right, core exercise, plank, and we're moving the dumbbell, all right? So grab the dumbbell that you wanna lift and move from side to side, set it right under your hand, hands under the shoulders, core nice and tight. Let's go two and one right here. Moving that dumbbell, replacing the hand, keeping the core tight, driving that belly button in and up. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Good, trying to keep those hips steady. Moving the dumbbell, right to left, left to right. <sighs> Replacing the hand right under the shoulders. Good, keep your eyes on your hands, guys. Don't tuck your chin to watch that dumbbell. Just keep moving positions. We've got 15 seconds. Good, then we're gonna go to the floor for a reverse crunch for one more core exercise. Core tight, keep those shoulders back. Here we go, here we go. Three, two, and one. All right, all the way over. No dumbbell for this exercise, actually. Set that aside. Core tight, feet on the floor, palms on the floor. We're gonna crunch and then tap. All right, let's go two and one right here. Big crunch and then tap, crunch, and tap. Good, exhale here, inhale here. And tap, and tap. Fingertips spread wide on the floor. That's your base, roll up, big crunch, lifting those hips up off the floor. And tap, and tap. Good job, core nice and tight. Reverse crunches, nice. All the way up and right back down. Good. All right, we've got about eight seconds here, guys. We're gonna come up for a sumo deadlift. Here we go, we've got three, two, and one. All right, all the way up. Grabbing those heavier dumbbells, right? Knees and toes out wide, right here. Knees and toes out wide, dumbbells out front. We're gonna hinge, come up and squeeze. Knees are soft, let's go two and one. Here we go, all the way over. Right back up and squeeze. Nice job, big hinge here. Knees and toes out wide, hinging over, coming up tall with a squeeze. Good. Knees and toes out wide in that sumo position. Knees are soft, okay? Hips are going back, core tight, coming up and squeezing all things glutes and inner thigh. All the way over and right back up. Nice job. Up and squeeze. Here we go. Good. 
Wrapping it up here, guys, with our sumo exercises. You've worked so hard, let's finish strong. Right here, we've got three, two, and one. All right, one dumbbell for what's next. We have sumo squats and heel pops, all right? So knees and toes out wide, sumo goblet, pop the heel right back up. Everybody ready? Let's go two and one. Knees and toes wide, press the knees wide, pop the heels right back up, wide. Pop the heels and up. Good, bring it down, pop those heels, press up and squeeze. Good, core tight. We got it, we got it. Lower, pop the heels, press up through the heels and squeeze. Good, down and pop, right back up. This is it guys, this is exercise 38. Great, we've got two more exercises. What a full body strength workout. We have hit everything. Right there, press up. Down and lower, pop those heels, press through the heels. We've got four, three, two, and one. All right, keeping one dumbbell, a lighter dumbbell, I'm gonna grab my eight. We've got a side lunge. We're gonna send the dumbbell through, come up tall, send it through the other side, all right? Jump in with me to the right, here we go. Side lunge, sitting back, up and send it. Send it back, good job. Sending it from the front, good. As you sit back in that heel, sit back in that hip, send that dumbbell through the front side. Good work, nice job. Side and up, sew it right under the leg. Nice job, sending it through, right back up. Nice work, side to side, left and right. Pressing out of that heel, come center. Other side, come center. Nice job, right here guys. Give me five more seconds. Four, three, two, and one. All right, wrapping it up right here, guys. We've got frog walks with a frog hop. Knees and toes out wide, dumbbell center. We're gonna walk up two, drop the dumbbell, give me a hop. Don't want the hop, just go down and up, all right? Get rid of the hop. Here we go, let's go three, two, and one. Frog walk, knees and toes wide, up, up, back, back, set the dumbbell down, give me a hop and grab it. Up, up, back, back, set the dumbbell down, hop it up, walk it up. We're gonna switch the lead, right and left, on our frog walks, now go left. Up, up, back, back, dumbbell down, and hop it up. Now let our right leads first, keep your chest up, Shoulders back, finish strong with me. Right here, guys. We've got 15 seconds. Good, grab that dumbbell, walk it up left. Or now we're right, actually. <laughs> Down and up, now left. Alternating either way. We've got four, three, two, and one. Woo! Nice job, guys. High five, 40 exercises, 40 minutes. You did it. Great. Grab your towel, grab your drink, bring it back to the floor, have a seat, extend those legs out, alternate those knees right and left. Great work. Woo! Save those frog walk hops for last, for obvious reasons, right? All right, give me eight more of these. Six, four, two, and one. All right, knees and toes out wide. Hands to the center right here. Drop those elbows if you can. Hold it there. Good, keep breathing, feel that breath slow down. Keep your hips to the floor. Good, walk it back up right there. Walk it back out maybe a little bit further and drop those elbows again. Good. Hold that stretch. Fantastic work, guys. 40 finish lines in 40 minutes, keeping it all um, strength today, right? I think we put our dumbbells down once. So great job. Let's bring that left leg in, keeping that right leg extended. Turn your chest towards the right leg and stretch over towards that right leg. Good job. Love it when we break up our no repeats, focusing on the muscle groups. I just love that. I feel like I can really um, feel and notice um, and keep my mind focused on that muscle group and really feel that attention 
to the detail of that muscle, right? Good job. We can really feel it come to fatigue that way. All right, chest towards the left leg, stretch it over. Good. Fun way to break it up every once in a while. Good job, hold that stretch over towards the left leg this time and right back up, good. Let's extend both legs out in front of you, crossing one leg over the other. Let's rotate side, stretching through that low back, good. Nice, and up and over, let's switch sides. Be sure to give me a thumbs up for this workout today, guys. I would so appreciate that. Love working out with you, the encouragement that you give me. Hopefully I'm providing some encouragement to you. Maybe, you, maybe pushing you to go a little harder, a little stronger, a little longer, and maybe even a little heavier than you normally would. So hopefully we are encouraging each other in that way. I know that, that you are for me. Good job, I know when I, uh, begin making a video I'm working out with each one of you and it really encourages me through each each finish line so hopefully I'm that encouragement for you all right extend that leg up overhead now good just holding that stretch and release grabbing above that ankle let's press that left elbow out into that left knee right there good and release let's change legs extending the left bringing the right up just hugging it up right there Nice, and now extend that leg up overhead, grabbing at the calf, just pull that leg over, getting a great hamstring stretch there. Good, and release. Now again, grabbing above the ankle with both hands, pressing that right elbow into the right knee. Hold that stretch, and release. Good, placing that right foot on the floor. Use that right foot to press all the way over onto your belly. Bringing those arms down right there under your shoulders, keeping those elbows slightly bent. Press up to a cobra, hold this stretch right here, extending those feet out behind you. Good, I need to come up a little bit. A little inch warm up <laughs> right there. Good, and now let's drive the hips back. Good, hips back, finding those toes, finding those heels right there. And now let's come rolling it all the way back up to this cobra. Again, elbows soft holding it here, and now drive the hips back again into that child's pose, arms up overhead, driving those hips back. Good, hold that stretch. From here, we're gonna press up to a pike, feet out behind you, press that head right there between the elbows, heels into the floor, and now let's release that stretch, just alternating the heels, pedal your heels up and down, nice. Let's get three, two, and one, good job. Walk those feet up to the hands. Or just hold it right here. Let's grab the elbows, drop your head. Good, just making a square there with the hands to the elbows, dropping your head in that square. Just relax and hang right there. Good, deep breath. And now let's roll it all the way up nice and slow. Good job, turn to the front, give me a few arm swings. Let's cross that right arm over the chest. Good, give it a little hug, wiggle those fingers. Fantastic work, guys. As always, you are crushing it with me. Each exercise, each finish line. What a privilege and a blessing to be working out with you guys. Wiggle those fingers right there on the left arm. Thanks again for working out with me. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I sure appreciate it. And I will see you guys again next time.